Hello, I'm Kyle Harris, Director of Local Optimization at DAC, and welcome to The Essential, your bite-sized guide to the most pressing topics in digital marketing today. Today's topic we'll be discussing is map spam. It's something affecting local search that could be costing you traffic and leads. Map spam is defined as fake listings propagating the map's channel. And you can tell from this example that cheap auto insurance in Port Chester isn't a real business as the storefront is actually an auto mechanic shop. It's created to steal traffic and leads from true businesses. Now, the reason that map spam exists is actually threefold. Number one is usage and visibility, where Google Maps is the number one map in the world with millions, if not billions of users. Number two is cost, where these listings were organic and cost nothing to create. And finally, with revenue, where spammers create these listings to actually steal traffic and leads and then sell it back to these real businesses. It's a problem, but luckily there is a solution. To fight spam, you simply need to do and pay attention to these three things. Number one, your competitive set. You know your competition, so anyone that shouldn't be in your market, you can most certainly go ahead and report. Number two is you'll need to become a sleuth and analyze very quickly. Does the listing have fake reviews? Does the listing you know, show an empty lot on Street View? Or does it have a keyword stuff business name? These are all telltale signs of fake fraudulent listings. And finally, the third thing you can do to help you with map spam is work with a technology provider that can automate this process. Getting rid of map spam is the easiest way to gain visibility on Google Maps. If there's less competition, you'll obviously show more. Once you've found spam, the question now becomes, how can you actually remove it? And luckily, Google has a very standard process to report and remove these bad actor listings. When you find a listing that is fake, what you're gonna to wanna to do is go ahead and click this, suggest an edit button on that listing. Then you'll follow the steps and select the reason for removal. And once Google has had time to review the edit, they'll hopefully publish, although they're not perfect at this. If successful, you'll get an email like this showing that your edit was published. So now that you know the problem, how to diagnose this, and the path to remove it, you should be on the path for generating more lead volume. Keep in mind though that map spam can pop up at any time, so this process is not a one and done scenario. You'll need to stay vigilant in your spam fighting efforts. I wish you luck and take care.